On a raw and rainy Sunday evening, the crowds still came. More than 100 people gathered at the New Hampshire State Veterans Cemetery in Boscoin to pause, to remember, and to honor the state service men and women who are no longer with us. I think it really speaks to our motto, live free or die, that with a large veteran population within our state, um, they realize the sacrifices that our men and women make every single day for the freedoms that we cherish. Every May 30th, rain or shine, the cemetery hosts its Memorial Day ceremony. Memorial Day is about honoring those who've died in the service of our country. Sean Buck is the director of the cemetery. He and his team are the caretakers of this hallowed ground and prepare it for this annual tradition. It's an honor to serve the veterans of this community. I'm a veteran, 21 years, retired Army, but serving veterans is a calling for all of us here. Veterans organizations, active military, join federal, state, and local dignitaries to pay their respects to the more than 13,000 buried here. This is our ability or our opportunity to honor those who have gone before us, who have paid the ultimate sacrifice. Today also marks the beginning of the cemetery's 100 days of remembrance. For the next 100 nights, every night at 7 p.m., we'll be playing taps right here at the Veterans Cemetery. And then after 9-11, we do it every Sunday at 1 o'clock. I don't say have a, a great weekend or have, on Memorial Day, I say have a peaceful weekend. And by peace, I mean have peace in yourself, but also give thanks. Remember those who've given their lives for our country so that we can be free and that we can celebrate here the way we want to. In Bosco and I'm Tim Callery, WMUR News 9.